Video Gamers Oasis. Website, YouTube channel. Mage's Initiation Reign of the Elements Hello uh, Retro Gamers, uh, YouTube uh, regulars to Video Gamers Oasis YouTube channel and newcomers. Welcome back to my YouTube channel Video Gamers Oasis and I'm Jeremy your host back again with our walkthrough of Mage's Initiation Reign of the Elements. We're continuing our adventure with Dark the Heroic Mage Initiate. He's a water mage and he's learning how to finish up his second task. Right now he's um, he's helping, um, he's been helping Falk uh, last episode. Falk, the son of Hawkane, the Lord of the Hawkmen or the Phytarians. And now he's with the, he's gained the trust of Hawkane and he's in the village, in the in the treetops of the, of the Phytarians. And he's going to attempt to work on solving some kind of uh, severe situation that uh, has developed with the uh, land dwellers and the Hawkings on the uh, Flytarians. So let's see if, if uh, in this episode we can uh, help out uh, D Dark in his adventure. Uh, before we begin our adventure, would you please be kind enough to like this video, add it to your favorites, leave comments below, share with your friends on social media. This is a YouTube channel uh, of retro, uh, walkthroughs, video game tutorials, uh, gamer and, and geek um, educational videos. Um, work This originally was created uh, to support my website videogamersvoices.com. You can click the link in the description to check it out, check out the progress. It's still under development, but I'm making some good progress. I'm working on my uh, drafts again, working on the, on the uh, blueprints again to uh, correct some and to more, put more detail into the website. But I promise you it's going to be really, really attractive and professional video game database of knowledge and affiliate also you can help support uh, the YouTube channel that I do by downloading the brave browser help support uh, creators on YouTube and on in the web website sphere by downloading the brave browser donate your bats BATs by watching the digital uh, watching the digital ads uh, with the brave browser why would you want it why would you want the brave browser in the first place well you get to uh, protect yourself on the internet from uh, annoying spyware, uh, pop-ups, um, adware, other nasty little uh, bugs that get on your, your browser. You get to protect yourself and you can earn digital tokens, BATs. Uh, it's a form of uh, digital, it's like Bitcoin, it's a B you can earn it and you can share it with other YouTubers who use the Brave Browser. Download the Brave Browser, donate your bats to me. Thank you so much for your support. And uh, one more thing, I almost forgot to mention, subscribe to Video Gamer Oasis and click the notification bell and you will be notified of future videos. Thanks so much for your support in this matter. Uh, let's get on with the adventure. Uh, <clears throat> restore the game. We're in Falk's Perch, load the game. Okay, so here, here we have, um, We have full, um, dark at the. The decking uh, seems strong enough to support my weight. Now, he, what he's going to do is he, he has to see what Falk's doing. Just want to just check something for a moment. All right, let's um, let's look at this hair, this character here, Condor. Condor. He is extremely good at what he does. He's one of the guards. Let's see if we could talk to him. Um. Okay, obviously, I, I don't want to go anywhere just yet. What's about, what about Hawkeye's perch? No need to ask for a lift. I can jump across the gap myself. All right, then. Farewell. Let's uh, jump across the gap. Let's right, reach out and touch someone. Boing! All right. Let's talk to this young, beautiful, young lady with, uh, she's actually a, a flatarian as well. She looks both formidable and accomplished in combat. I would not like to test her resolve. 
Can we talk to her? Oh. Halt, human. Chief Arcane desires no audience with you at this time. All right then. Well, she's loyal to her leader. Move on. Whoa! There you go. That's how you do it. Falk's perch. All right then. Let's get in here. Let's talk to Falk. Hello again. Oh, I there didn't he is. thank you properly before. Please know I'm grateful for your aid. I'm glad I could help. Tell me, is there any way to see your father? As an outsider, you will not be able to visit my father's perch without an offering of some kind. Humans are known for their tools and crafts, at least the ones you are permitted to use. Perhaps you could make something for him. Make something for him, interesting. The Flytarian heir appears a lot older than his 14 years. He masks the pain of his recent injury well. Mm -hmm. In our last episode, he fell from a perch. He fell f from high above the mountains. Someone had shot a fiery arrow at him or something. Save the game. Uh, Falk's perch. Say replace the game. Yes. All right. And now I'm going to talk to this gentleman. Falk. I was born 14 years ago, here in my mother's perch. My family has always ruled Flytaria. I wonder, though, if my people could accept a leader who cannot fly. Tell me about your mother. She died six years ago. I try not to think about her, but sometimes it is difficult. Tell me about your friends. There are few Flytarians my age in the valley, and they do not share my interest in what is beyond it. How old are you? Sixteen. Uh, I had hoped that, when I am of age, my father would allow me to leave the valley for a time, as he did. I doubt that will ever happen now. Why have you come here? To obtain a griffin's egg. That's the mission. You might find that a challenge. Hmm. Tell me about griffins. The griffins are difficult to approach, and they do not trust strangers. Furthermore, my father will not allow you near them until you have gained his trust. How about something else? Um, for, tell me about your friends. There are few Flytarians my age in the valley, and they do not share my interest in what is beyond it. How old are you? Sixteen. Uh, to obtain a gr You might- Okay, we've already talked about that. How about something else? Uh, tell me about Chief Hawkeye. My father is a good leader, strong, devoted, and proud. I only hope I can do him justice when it is my turn, if it is ever my turn. Tell me about your father. Being the son of the chief is a mixed blessing. Oh, yeah. What of your father? I do not know him, at least not anymore. I haven't seen my family for many years. That mm. must be difficult. I try not to think about it it is an honor to discover your chosen worth the sacrifice so i've been told they wouldn't remember me anyway i doubt that tell me about flytaria this is the only home i have ever known a few flytarians ever leave the valley my father was one of them tell me about hawkane's travels before she died my mother told me of how father often left the mountains he was different then, more curious and trusting. Hmm. She told me of his adventures and his interest in the great structures which stood tall and spun with wooden feathers. Windmills? Wow. He did not know what they were called or what they were for, but they always fascinated him. Interesting. Tell me about uh, Ignor. I have always been interested in the human town ever since I glimpsed it from Crag Peak when I was very small. Assault? It must sound strange, but I am not angry. I know I should not have approached the town. Mm. Losing a wing is like your kind losing a leg. As my father says, some lessons can only be learned through the hardest sacrifice. Oh yeah. I never imagined this though. 
injured his, his wing or something else. Um, to thank you. Thanks. For letting you into our valley? It was the least I could do. If you can prove that humans are not responsible for these thefts, maybe my father will change his mind about them. A uh, favor. Can I ask a favor from you? You do not owe me anything, except perhaps to learn what really happened to the missing items. How about something else? Um, thefts. When you asked my father whether he had searched for the stolen property, I wondered how humans could get around unseen unless they were mages. Oh. Mages? You are a mage, yes? Ah, uh, yeah. Nearly. Get there. I've heard about your kind. You are not like other humans. Could a mage have stolen those things? It is true that some can move about unseen, but those same mages could not ascend your perches unnoticed. How about something else? Uh, bye for now. Drop by again soon. Let's save our game. Elk's perch. Okay. How's our character doing? <sighs> level 4, experience 240, next level 270. Not so bad. Not so shabby. We have 30 out of 40 health and 22 out of 40 mana. I wonder if we can bump up our character. Um, how about some mage's water? Forty or forty mana, but we don't have anything to heal us with. I can't. A loaf of bread, maybe. Will that heal me? Thirty-four out of forty health, not so bad. Okay, I eat the bread. Let's uh. Save the game. All right. Let's look around this place. Falk's closet. I can imagine the sort of things he keeps in there. I wonder what happened if I look at, if I look into his closet. Odds are Falk would not appreciate me rummaging through his personal effects. What's this? Portrait? The heir himself. Painted a few years ago by the looks. Is this a bookshelf? Texts pertaining to Flitarian history, culture, and civil duties. A cabinet rests against the back wall. It's nice, nice, it's a nice, uh, nice dive he's got. A boy's best friend. Slingshot. Bird carving. Falk keeps a wooden carving of a bird on his desk. Tools for carving. Falk must be quite skilled. Tools for carving. I wonder if I could use those tools. It wouldn't look good in my private hall. Tools. I don't know anything about woodcraft. Hmm. Elk's perch. Is there anything I can ask him about? Right Drop for now. By again soon. I'm gonna do some investigating. Oh, Falk scratch marks. What? What is that? These scratches were made by Falk. They mark his territorial claim on this perch. Just like a bird of prey would do that in real life. 